a story about an eight-year-old boy who steals bread to survive. Spring and summer in Germany. Germans use propaganda to influence citizens. An eight-year-old boy who thinks his name is Stop Thief meets a 13-year-old boy named Yuri who is also an orphan. They meet while trying to steal the same loaf of bread from the same woman. Stop Thief met the other boys in the barn that Yuri introduced him to. They were smoking cigarettes and hanging out and talking and um, they decided that he was a gypsy because of the yellow stone that he wore around his neck. Stop Thief had never had a bath, so Yuri went around trying to find water in the spigots of the rubble stores that were in rubble, and he washed them up for the very first time. The two boys took shelter in, a near, in an abandoned barber shop. Stop Thief had never had a haircut. He had never had his hair brushed. So Yuri took care of him and, and took him into the upstairs of the barber shop cut his hair, and cleaned him up. As the boys jumped an illegal ride on a streetcar, they watched as one of their friends had stolen a lamp run down the street and fall. A crowd come around him, and then they got away. Then the bombs came, and uh, the trolley was left unattended, so the boys decided to have a little fun, and they grabbed the trolley and started driving it until they wrecked it into a store. Germany had created a new type of warfare called the Blitz, Blitzkrieg, where they attacked from three different angles, from the ground, from the air, and from different sides. This meant that Poland was occupied. Stop Thief was a first-hand witness to the jackboots occupying Poland. A jackboot is a German soldier. He stumbled upon the uh, parade and walked through the boots as one soldier picked him up and sent him on his way. Poland succumbs. Warsaw fell to the Germans on September 27, 1939.